What is Slake YouTube? This is Juan from the Gamers Ministry. And you know what? I just had to go to bed, rest, and now I'm back at it again. Well, actually, at the end of the day, it's February 28th, 2012, and the footage that we're watching is from December 30, 2011. And currently, it's 24 hours later, or more or less, it's now 11.17 p.m. So, yeah. Time to go. <laughs> time to comment now. Instead of time to go to work, I was gonna say time to comment now. But yeah, um, yeah. Uh, last week I didn't get a chance to upload the seven episodes I promised per week. So, or I try to at least, you know, accomplish that. So I am doing my very best to make it all work. Work this, my marriage, my oh, you know, every every single aspect of my life. It's hard work, but you know, I'll figure it out. Um, so today I want to celebrate because we are at episode 19 of this LP and it's my, I guess my first major LP. This is a 35 episode LP. I, I still think that this is probably the shortest episode playlist for Assassin's Creed. It's only going to end up being 35 episodes. And that's pretty exciting, um, because I'm I, I pride myself in saving my viewers' times. I not to I'm not, I'm not dis dissing my other fellow LPers, but I mean I I just I don't like it when there's some episodes that are just simply they're way dragged out, and they just simply you know they take a long time to get through, and I I, just, I don't like it. So I, I really I pretty pride myself in making this one really short. And we made it to the objective, so let's see. Ooh, wow, that's awesome. King Richard. The Lionheart or something like that. I was that. told they would be held as prisoners and used to barter for the release of our men. The Saracens would not have honored that end of the bargain. You know this to be true. I did you a favor. <laughs> oh, yes. A great favor indeed. Now our enemies will be that much stronger in their convictions. Fight that much harder. I know our enemy well. They will not be emboldened, but filled with fear. Tell me, how is it you know the intentions of our enemy so well? You who forsake the field of battle to play at politics? I did what was right, what was just. You swore an oath to uphold the work of God, William. But that is not what I see here. No, I see a man who's trampled it. Your words are most unkind, my liege. I would hope I might have earned your trust by now. You are Arca's regent, William, set to rule in my stead. How much more trust is required? Perhaps you'd like my crown. You missed the point. But this is nothing new. Much as I'd like to waste my day trading words with you, I have a war to fight. We'll have to continue this another time. Do not let me delay you then, your grace. Yeah, just this is not a spoiler, but um, the Crusaders. No place for men like him in the new world. Send word that I wish to speak with the troops. We must ensure that everyone is doing their part. Warn them that any negligence will be severely punished. I'm in no mood to be trifled with today. Yes, my lord. The rest of you, follow me. Yeah, the the Crusaders. They they lost this crusade. They they yeah they lost it. Uh, Abu Nakur law won uh, a major battle. I don't remember which one it is, but yeah, he won a major battle. Anyway, so long story short, this episode is going to be very different from the, all the previous ones because here's what I plan to do: instead of just doing what other players do and you know keep all all the fails in our one video and then just simply drag out the LP, here's what you're going to have. Uh, here's a completely different scene because first thing you see on the l lower left corner is that uh, another the original run is when I was going in and I fail and that's what you're gonna be seeing there on the main screen what you're gonna see be seeing is me actually tagging the actual main object I mean like my do my I, my successful run on the lower left what happens is I I mess up and they caught catch me so yeah so for for this, I, I think that some this uh, starting this target is when things start to get really interesting in gameplay wise because you can actually do have multiple paths to reach your objective and really you know get a choice on how you want to do this and tackle the objective. What I'm showing you right now is what I think is the probably the stealthiest way 
to approach your target. Let's see. Okay, so yeah, um, oh yeah, I, I, somewhere around this area, there's a really glitched out platform. It's like there's, a, oh yeah, I think that, yeah, that's the one it. <laughs> that like the this the road is cut in the middle of the air and it's just it was supposedly it's just floating in midair. Um, the reason why these things happen in games and they don't fall is because the there's a p very you know because that's what I do I code and stuff. Um, the object is placed in a certain coordinate on the map, so that's why you don't have. Uh, a form of realistic physics where the things should fall, but it's not. That's what happening. So, yeah. You know what? Actually, I do consider every once in a while actually do making programming videos and teach you guys how to make software. I I like teaching, as you already know. I'm a I'm a youth leader, and I teach all the time, and that's always always been a passion of mine. Ever since I was kid, I was a kid. Uh, other kids would diss me because I would try to explain absolutely everything and find that annoying that annoying about me but meh so let's see where are we right here in all of this well we're almost there we're approaching oh yeah one thing to notice that if you make it to where uh, William is far fast enough uh, he there's two guys over there or two victims and that he kills them and he says something about them I, I couldn't get there fast enough in this run, so I apologize there. But if any of you viewers out there know what he says, please post the commentary. And everybody, just like that comment so everybody can, you know, anyone that sees the video can see what he says to them before he kills them. Oh, yeah. So... I I'm right now as I'm as I'm watching and and commenting this video um the video I have it in really 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 ultra low settings so it can just render fast enough as I have both screens right now um so the the process is just pretty hard so meaning the thing is that the radio is running pretty slow so okay I I wonder I don't know I don't know if I ran out of knives or something that's why I went with the hidden knife so anyway you see those two dead guys down there that's the guys I was telling you about and there's uh, Richard right there I'm sorry William I mean William is right there so oh uh, great uh, never mind I, f I forgot his name I think it's William and Richard the Lionheart was the English King I think it was I don't remember now but yeah anyway once you've come down this path as you'll see he won't even notice you coming in from the top or making all the noise when you land like so oh he didn't even hear that Oop. and now we got him whoop rest now your schemes are at an end what do you know of my work I know that you are going to murder Richard and claim Appa for your son, Conrad. <laughs> for Conrad? My son is an arse, unfit to lead his host, let alone a kingdom. And Richard, the only know is no better, blinded as he is by faith in the insubstantial. Akra does not belong to either of them. Then who? The city belongs to its people. How can you claim to speak for the citizens? You stole their food, disciplined them without mercy. Forced them into service under you. Everything I did, I did to prepare them for the new world. Stole their food? No. I took possession so that when the lean times came, it might be rationed properly. <coughs> Look around. My district is without crime, save those committed by you and your ilk. And as for the conscription, they were not being trained to fight. They were being taught the merits of order and discipline. These things are hardly evil. No matter how noble you believe your intentions, these acts are cruel and cannot continue. <laughs> we'll see how sweet they are, the fruits of your labors. You do not free the cities as you believe, but rather damn them. And in the end, you'll have only yourself to blame. You, who speak of good intentions. Oh 
great. Now I'm surrounded. Oh snap! No, I'm just kidding. Let's go straight what to the Rafik. William of Montferrat is dead, and with him his plans for betrayal. You've done well keeping Akka from his hands. But why now, when the Crusaders require unity most? Could have waited. Waited for what? For Richard to return and discover his schemes? No. It was the perfect time for him to strike. Strange. I was sure he meant to take Akka for Conrad. Yet he claimed this was not his plan. You cannot trust the words of a snake, which even in death produces venom. I should discuss this with Al Muallim. Yes, my friend. Make haste for Masia. I am sure he is eager for news. Okay. Now let's go talk to Al Muallim. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. More recent one. Come, Altair. I would have news of your progress. I've done as you've asked. Good, good. I sense your thoughts are elsewhere. Speak your mind. Each man I'm sent to kill speaks cryptic words to me. Each time I come to you and ask for answers. Each time you give only riddles in exchange. But no more. Who are you to say no more? I'm the one who does the killing. If you want it to continue, you'll speak straight with me for once. Tread carefully, boy. I do not like your tone. And I do not like your deception. I have offered you a chance to restore your lost honor. Not lost. Taken. By you. And then you've sent me to fetch it again like some damn dog. It seems I'll need to find another. A shame. You showed great potential. I think if you had another, you'd have sent him long ago. You said the answer to my question would arise when I no longer needed to ask it. So I will not ask. I demand you tell me what binds these men. Yeah, boy. Uh, what you say is true. These men are connected by a blood oath not unlike our own. Who are they? Non nobis, domine non nobis. Templars. Now you see the true reach of Robert de Sal. All of these men, leaders of cities, commanders of armies, all pledge allegiance to his cause. Their works are not meant to be viewed on their own, are they? But as a whole, what do they desire? Conquest. They seek the Holy Land not in the name of God, but for themselves. What of Richard? Salah ad -Din? Any who oppose the Templars will be destroyed. Be assured they have the means to accomplish it. Then they must be stopped. That is why we do our work, Altair. To ensure a future free of such things. Why did you hide the truth from me? That you might pierce the veil yourself. Like any task, knowledge precedes action. Information learned is more valuable than information given. Besides, your recent behavior had not inspired much confidence. I see. Altair, your mission has not changed. Merely the context within which you perceive it. And armed with this knowledge, I might better understand those Templars that remain. Is there anything else you want to know? What about the treasure Malik retrieved from Solomon's temple? Robert seemed desperate to have it back. In time, Altair, all will become clear. Just as the role of the Templars has revealed itself to you, so too will the nature of their treasure. For now, take comfort in the fact that it is not in their hands, but ours. If this is your desire, it is. You are restored another rank. Take back your weapon. Use it to bring honor to the Brotherhood. Altair, before you go... Yes? How did you know I wouldn't kill you? Truth be told, Master, I didn't. I took a leap of faith. <laughs> well played, Altair. Well played. Well, guys, that's the end of this episode, and we'll talk more on the next one. God bless you. See you next bit. Bye.